Hey YouTube, it's Wasley339 or I'm an Android Girl on Twitter. I'm here doing a app review, actually two app reviews. So I'm going to get right into it. Um, just to let you guys know before I even start, I am running Superbad version 1.6. So with that said, let me get into it. Um, the first ROM that I'm going to be reviewing is a ROM called ROM is a ROM, is an app <laughs> called ROM Manager. So click on that. And um, just to give you guys a little background, ROM Manager, what it pretty much allows you to do is um, flash ROMs, uh, partition your SD card, create backups, um, restore a backup, um, fix permissions, pretty much everything that you would normally do inside of recovery mode, you can do right within this application. Um, the whole catch with the whole deal is that you actually have to flash clockwork mod recovery image. You have to flash their recovery image in order for this to work. You cannot use Amon Raz or Cyanogen's recovery image. You have to use their recovery image. And it's very, very simple. Um, once you, oh, and this also has uh, two um, versions of this um, application. This is the free version that I have, but they have a premium version or paid version for $3.99. It's definitely worth the money. Um, I highly recommend just go ahead and buying this particular application because ROM Manager literally update they update this application at least once a week. It, from from my experience so far, they update this a lot. And if you're trying to get this app for free, it's not one of those apps that you can get for free because when you get it for free and once the license expires on it, you're going to need to get it again. And it's just a lot of searching, and it's just better off just going go ahead and paying the you know the three ninety nine. So. Back to the application itself. Um, in order to, when you first uh, install it, if you do the free version, just you know, making sure you want it and you like the um, application like I'm doing before I actually purchase it, um, only these two options will be um, clickable, I guess. All of these other options will be uh, darkened out, so you cannot use them. You have to flash the Clockwork Mod Recovery. And it's very easy. All you have to do is just click on it, and it's going to ask you what uh, phone you're using, and you select your phone, and it installs very quickly. It flashes very, very quickly. Um, and at any time, if you just want to, um, you know, go back to your previous recovery image, it saves it. So as you can see right here, um, I have the Clockwork Recovery um, work going on my phone now, but if I want to go back to I'm a Ra, uh, 1.7.0. All I have to do is click that, and I'm back at Amon Ra. So um, that's that's what made me feel like, okay, you know, I'll go ahead and flash the recovery image. I can go right back to my old recovery image, and you know, I really trusted this app, and it it it, it turned out to be a really 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 good app. So you can install um, ROM straight from your SD card. So I'm gonna click on my SD card, and um, down here, let's see. Uh, Chromatic, if I were to click on Chromatic, um, you can, these are the pre-installation um, kind of prerequisites for, you know, flashing a ROM. You always want to make sure that you do a data wipe and cache wipe. So I would click that, and it can actually back up the existing ROM for you just in case something doesn't go right, you know, something doesn't go right. You can just do kind of like a nano backup with that, and you can click that, and then you would click OK, and it will go ahead and flash the ROM. Now, when it flashes the ROM, it does take you into recovery mode. You do go into recovery mode, but, you know, you don't really have to press any other buttons. You just kind of let it, you know, let it do its thing in recovery, and, you know, you'll be all good. You can download a ROM. This is only available for premium users or for um, people who have the paid version, but you can download ROMs. Um, it'll actually notice what... ROM you're running currently, which is super bad version 1.6, and it'll check for updates. But just like the download of ROM, you have to be a premium user. Um, it also can install a ROM from a QR code. So if you have that, if you have a barcode scanner and you have that square QR code, you can just scan it and get it like that. Um, down here at these two options, you have uh, you can manage and restore backup. So click on that. I've actually made a backup of this particular ROM that I'm running now, and you can just name it what you want. So you can manage your backups there. You can delete them or, and you know, flash them or whatever. And here you can back up your current ROM. Just name it what you want. 
press OK and back it up. Um, you can fix permissions. You can partition your SD card. But the um, EXT sizes are preset to 128, 550, I'm sorry, 128, 256, and 512. So um, that's kind of, you know, you kind of have to, you know, go within these means. You can't choose your own EXT size like you can in maybe um, I'm in Rise Recovery. And um, as I said before, the option to always flash back to your previous recovery. And down here it just has all the clockwork uh, recoveries that they've, you know, they've had. So, but in all in all, guys, this is definitely, definitely um, a good ROM to have. This is, um, I'm sorry, a good app to have because if you're new to flashing um, ROMs and themes and partitioning your SD card, this is kind of like a foolproof way to make sure you do everything right and you know not saying that you can't break your phone or you can't you know do damage to your phone with using this application but it definitely makes it a lot easier for people who are just getting the feel of um, you know playing around with the recovery and flashing ROMs and things of that nature so definitely 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 a good ROM to have and I encourage everybody to go out and um, why do I keep calling this a ROM? <laughs> this is definitely a good app to have maybe because it's called ROM Manager it's definitely a good app to have I encourage everybody to go out and uh, install this application on their phone and definitely check me out um, on Twitter I'm an Android girl and thanks for watching guys